So, if you remember last year, me and Haz uh, did the So Much of Nice Tour Part 1, and I did a recap after, which I... <laughs> It was just me, but now I got him here at this time. So instead of five shows, we did six, and then yeah. also in 22 days. So and we had a lot of the same acts at every show too. Talk about how you're so much of nice, because this is a so much of. Nice First show, of right? all, we had to find a ride because it's like an hour and a half out of town driving. Yeah. Um, <laughs> so we got to find. That's the very difficult part. Uh, so shout out to Stacy. She hooked us up the ride. I had to work till 10 or 11, 10 o'clock. Got a lift to Mission. Uh, met up with a friend of mine out there who came to the show too, so I knew somebody at least besides everybody performing. First time I played in Mission and the first time I played at Sniper's Pool Hall, uh, so yeah, I got there late, which became a trend throughout the tour, but uh, it's a good spot. Shout out to Aaron, thanks for hooking us up with that. We'll, we'll be back there every now and then. Um, and the USB situation with Jay Clausen, that was pretty funny because he's like make sure you have my fucking USB I was like okay I have it it's one of the only things I made sure that I brought one of the only things that I needed so I give it to him I was like here you go man your sets coming up here's your USB and he's like yo man this isn't even the same color as my USB this is this I was like isn't it yours He's like, no, man. Uh, you gotta be kidding me, man. You're joking, right? He's, I swear to God, this is not my USB. Fuck. Up. Fuck. What are we gonna do? This guy, it's, it's, yeah, and it's one of the only all ages shows. So, one of the only shows that Clausen can perform at. It was an all ages show. Yeah, right? Because he's 17. So I'm like, fuck, man. I got you your set slot and everything. Okay, this is what we're gonna do. We're gonna find someone who has an instrumental. Uh, we've never heard these instrumentals before. Yo, you got some random instrumentals we could just rock quick. I've never heard the beat before. I threw the beat on. Uh, all three of us did the first song, I think. We mixed it with freestyles and double time and triple time. Like, some of it was written, some of it was freestyle, but... Uh, like a hundred percent of it was just killed. It was uh, one of the better sets of the night, I thought. A couple of the shows, as you'll see, it's like go as we go along. Uh, some of the footage isn't very great, so we'll have to rekindle you with stories and paint the picture for you that you were there because the footage didn't get it. But this yeah. time there's some good footage. I felt this our, our set was, um, you know, it, we knew what we were doing, but it was the first show, so I was kind of like it was sloppy at some parts, on my parts at least. But I mean, everyone's like, it was good. You know, but oh, okay. Swinging, I ain't coming out stealth. Put the soft black ass wraps back up on the shelf. Hanging in my small town, that's where you'll find me. Raised in the motherfucking 1990. Uh, the next night, uh, Wolf Bar in Maple Ridge. Um, first time I've, I, I've ever done back-to-back -back shows. Um, I know he's done shows, five shows in a day before or something like that, but uh, <laughs> the sure. Wolf Bar is cool. It's a cool place. We like coming there. I, I, I learned that place through the rapist uh, from Maple Ridge, Maple Ridge Rap Group, um, and then just spread like wildfire from there. Everyone's doing shows there now. It's like the new Olympia on, in Maple Ridge, but uh, we did a show there, so much of free. <laughs> This was also the day that like, oh fuck, we're tired of seeing Blue Team Blue go on all, early all the time when they kill it, so we got, we're gonna put them on right before well, us, the, the, near the very end. This one was the early one. Oh really? Yeah, it was. The, oh. The, the, you're thinking about the most recent show. Oh, okay, okay, I'm getting them mixed up, my bad. I'm stupid to cross my path, I got some real top shutters to blast your ass. I fly a new one out of town, it's the red eye flight. This is the day I was taking it like really seriously for some reason and I was just like trying you to You gotta kill this one. Yeah, no, not even like that. I'm like setting up a merch table at like 7.30 p.m. There's nice. like no one there for the next three and a half hours. <laughs> that's pretty cool. See, that's what professionals do. When I say wolf, you say bar, wolf, bar, wolf, bar. Uh, our set was okay, not that good. Yeah, it, it was drunk. It was like it was a uh, drunk set. But regardless, though, you know, we uh, we thought the wolf show 
pretty solid opening weekend for that for the tour. Yeah, yeah, yeah. it was good. Here's to a fun view. Tell them how you're so much of nice. Tell them so much of nice. 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 We did a show at the rickshaw on March 8th. My friend Rakula, aka Dream Girl, hooked us up with that one, uh, part of a lobby hop event. It's uh, hopefully a monthly thing. Hopefully. Well, uh, well, first I had to work all day, and straight after work I had to get two. Uh, uh, Coquitlam to pick up uh, merchandise for the show, uh, the B&E right. shirts. I had to get my B&E shirts uh, as well as CDs, a stack of CDs, as well as drop off a poster and uh, pay for security for the show the next day. Yeah, we rolled up around, I don't know, fucking 10 o'clock to the sound check, which has, says is, uh, was better. And the actual set. They got a lot of like claps and cheers <laughs> and stuff, but like compared to our other set, not as much. It was funny because I wasn't. Uh, we, we weren't really, expecting an applause after, but there was. I wasn't expecting an actual sound check because most of the shows you go to, the sound checks is they just kind of put your USB or your CD and they just make sure it plays. And Thanks, then they're like, bye. See ya. I must ask you a question, but I'll save it for the latte. Yeah, what about this fucking dude? Told me he was broken traveling. Told me to go tails, but the rest ran to gambling. Messed him with a friend of mine, his whole style was locked. So I asked a couple questions. I decided to get the best. Yeah, I was. He was married, but it recently admitted. And his friends were quite confused that his son changed of image. I was in this uh, DRS group with my buddy Dex and some other dudes we met named Clint and Dana. And uh, Dana was at the show, as well as. Uh, uh, Rad Stewart, like I also knew him from the same kind of crew, from the same kind of time, all through uh, the Hobie Bloody Dico. And so it was kind of cool to see those two guys after like so many years of not seeing them. See, we were opening for friends, uh, for friends with the help, and they had their name on the Rickshaw Theater um, on the fucking headliner out front. We had our name on the chalkboard. It was, we were chalkboard worthy. <laughs> yeah, yeah, but it was cool. The section where we were at, there was no stage. We were ground level, and uh, people were like sitting on a bench or something on the side. Yeah, yeah it was interesting. Yeah, but they were into it. It was good shit. Uh, definitely want to come back to that shit. We love the Vancouver shows. <laughs> I can't really speak on the Olympia show on March 9th. The first thing I will say though is uh, it was the first time in 15 months that I did a show at Olympia Pizza in Surrey. <laughs> This guy was there all night, and I'm sure he'll start it. the rapper's ball. Thirty-three performers. I'm pretty proud of myself for that. I think that's a good accomplishment. Thirty, uh, like. Fucking three and a half hours <laughs> worth of entertainment yeah. with 33 different dope artists. I hope a lot of people network that night. Uh, we shot some good freestyle cipher footage. Yes, that on. was the best footage we shot because the show footage that you're watching is fucking terrible. A lot of people saw that uh, like the songs would get cut into the middle of some people's sets sometimes <laughs> later in the night like it started off really clean and crisp but then started to get a little sloppy like the playlist would just switch from someone's set to like a biggie song <laughs> Anyways, it was a good set. It was a dope set. The night before, me and Tyro were like, "Okay, let's uh, let's give give him something really, 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 really short and sweet." Yeah, I was yeah. like, "Okay, we've been doing a 15, 20 minute set. Let's make it fucking 12 That's minutes." That's right. Yeah, we'll that do, was the one. We'll do one verse of each song. Whatever. It was the good though. Song. It was good. So much energy. I, I throw on the slippers, pajama pants, perform, throw a beer on his head. It was dope. <laughs> Then 
Nanaimo that has it and go to the Nanaimo show. Uh, I did uh, with uh, everybody else. Uh, I didn't get a lot of sleep. I uh, got to the bus stop at like 7 in the morning to the ferry and stayed up for about 24 hours, partied my ass off. The Rathmus came to the to the island as well this time. We, we gave them that <laughs> that island experience or whatever, you know, they hadn't been on Maple Ridge. They, they kind of slid into the show as I slid out of the show. We made a trade. We traded Arcee to Hazard for the rap yeah. in the show. I think it was a fair trade, you know. Um, I'll give you this one guy for those six guys. <laughs> Go, motherfucker. Boy, I ain't even here. Go, motherfucker. No, I ain't even here. I'm Got to the Nanaimo in the morning, met up with a friend of mine, you know, just the simple, basic blazing and drinking all day shit. Recorded a song with Anti Heroes Alliance. Anti Heroes is so sad, and I'm so sad till the day I die. I rep the Nanaimo Anti Heroes, and we flow. Fuck who you know, it's about how you flow. And I come from the shadows where the streets stay cold, and you stand on your feet or fall on your own. We don't as it's too bad you, didn't, you couldn't make it, right? But you know, it was a good show. Uh, we loved playing the Nanaimo, especially at the Camby. That's where the show was. Play nice with Diddy! Creepy kids are what we are. Creepy kids are what we are. Did the show half cut? Great set. I thought it was a great set that I did actually. We have a lot of appreciation and a lot of love on the island, and you know we give that back in return. So uh, you know we got a good hookup at the Camby, and we hope to do more shows there in the future. Ridge for our second wolf show at the Oh wolf yeah, yeah, I was really looking forward to that. Now we got the wolf. Oh, now we got the wolf. Now we got the wolf. Oh, now we got the wolf. 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 Jay Adam and Tiger came out. Jay Adam and Tiger Lee and uh Rappus as usual at the wolf. Uh, vicious. Oh, great double B. Sets earlier in the evening. If you uh, like, we like to, we like to open it up and warm up, warm yeah. up with the shit. If you come to our shows, not only do you see the headliners last, you can see them early as well too. So you know, there's no the best way to do it. Yeah. So, every song we did that night, you can find us at visually, like, actually legit dope edited videos of us facing songs. Yeah. yeah, right? <laughs> Go 
Okay, open the new tab right now. Go to YouTube. Yeah, yeah RC the Hazard, Tyro James. Here I am again. RC the Hazard, Tyro James. Terminal, Terminal illness. Uh, Tyro James. So much of nice. Yeah. Uh, what else we got? Tons. There's tons. I mean, yeah. that's I mean, good for now. We have so Something many. Something comes this way. We. <laughs> One more time, shout out to Blue Team Blue and Rapids for getting on every single, pretty much every Pretty much every one, 90% of all the shows yeah, are Blue Team Blue. Yeah, 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 Blue Team Blue, Rapids, and us too, we're pretty much on every show. Yeah. It was good, yeah. you know, and uh, yeah. And, yeah, and to the people who were on a couple shows too, we have what's up, uh, like Noise. They were on a couple yeah. of them, uh, The Ghost was on a couple The Ghost, of them. yeah. Way too many people to name. <laughs>